Welcome back everybody, I'm the Blonde Fox, and today we're going to continue playing some more Genshin Impact. In the last episode, we did some dailies and we did a lot of talking and catching up because it had been quite a while since I recorded, so I wanted to fill you guys in on everything that had been going on me personally, as well as just what our plan kind of is for the future and whatnot, for how we're going to handle Fontaine, and how we're going to kind of handle everything else, like our characters, uh, what we're going to do in the free time, other stuff like that. So the plan is still we're going to be doing some more artifact farming and more weapon leveling up stuff as much as we can, talent levels, etc. Trying to focus on that to get our characters stronger because they're getting there, they're just still not strong enough to where I feel like we can go to Fontaine successfully. Not that Fontaine is too difficult from what I have been able to explore personally without messing up the story. As I said in the past, I have not done the story at all. But from what I have been able to do, it, it's still a little bit more difficult than what we've been facing. So I think it'd be good to have. But yeah, so we're just going to be grinding and continuing on the grind for probably the next couple of episodes. And that's pretty much it. So remember to like the video if you like and subscribe if you some more. Without further ado, let's get right to it. Okay. So, so far we're doing good. We still need a Sans, I believe. No, no, no. We got a Sans. We need a Goblet. Wait, the... Is that Goblet that I got not good enough then? Wait. See, I already forgot what I was going for. Yeah, I was going for a goblet. I got a purple goblet of the set I was winning, but it wasn't good yet because it was physical damage bonus. I need... I saved this one just in case I have to use it, but okay. So we're still going goblet or hat. Goblet or hat. We need either animal damage bonus or crit damage There's for those. No such thing okay. Pure freedom in this world. Hey. I kind of forgot for a second what we were going for originally. Gotcha. The wind rises. Go oh, nice. Try to stay flying around. And slam it down. Oh, I hate that mushroom guy. So annoying. Just try to get as much going off as at once as I can. And then switch back to Galen. Try to get rid of the mushroom guys first, because they're the most annoying. And because they don't actually resist the elements, so I can use her to take them out. Let's see, they do that, and it's annoying, and I hate it. Go, sweet. Thank you, Shinobu. Activate that. Go. I'm gonna go ahead and just take him out. Should be pretty easy. Man, even he's not going down. That's weird. Gotcha. Yeah, we should be able to take him out pretty quick. Unless he does that, that's annoying. There we go, knock him down. The gale. There we go. Yeah, the I definitely gale. need to get his artifacts leveled up, but I just I want to wait until we get this one, and then I'll, I automatically just hit the use the condensed resin. I need to remember that I can use the regular resin here for the couple of times, the first couple of times. Okay, what are you? HP percentage. Ah, getting lots of this set now, which is a little bit disheartening. I'll look at him to see if it's anything useful. That one's not half bad, but again, we're not using that set. Okay, round three. See what I'm telling you guys, though? I get, like, one or two good artifacts, and then everything else is just horrible. But yet, you know, knock on wood, but on my personal account, my artifact farming is usually, like, god tier every time. I don't know how, but it is. Maybe I use all of my luck on that account. Need to save some for this one, right? Really? I hit triangle, but whatever. Go, come on. Stay away from me, mushroom. Go. Really? I saw that coming. It's like, there's no way that's gonna hit me head on, right? Oh my gosh, I hate these mushroom guys. They're so annoying. Great, now there's one behind me. Uh, here, let's... That, that, and then if we... Are you kidding me? 
I was tapping triangle like crazy because I was like, okay, I wanted to use her triangle. That's so messed up. Quietly now. Uh. Gotcha. What's stupid is the first couple of times we did this domain, it went like perfect. It's all these guys' fault. I hate these stupid mushroom guys. See, they do that, which gets me like stun locked, which screws me up even more. Okay, Nahida, I keep forgetting that they're not. I don't have that on them either. We're just gonna make him take so much more damage. I need to remember to do that more. Seriously? <sighs> this is just so annoying. And the problem is it wouldn't feel so bad if we were actually getting at least, you know, even if it was only one artifact each time that was actually usable. But the fact that we're not even getting one usable artifact each run, it's like, it's just kind of pathetic. And I know I'm not even running at like a good enough level, so that's probably what's causing it, but still. I mean, we are fighting level 80s though, so I guess this isn't that bad. I shouldn't complain. I mean, we got really lucky with other stuff, too. I mean, the fact that we got Wanderer when we did at such low pity, I mean, that's pretty lucky. Here we go. Okay, let's try this again. Come on. Looking for a goblet. Oh my gosh, seriously, not even any of the set that I was winning. Gosh. I mean, that was not half bad for a circlet, but... Oh my gosh. Okay, how much longer till our food's back that we can bring her back? Okay, we can bring her back. Okay, do that. Let's go ahead and get some food. Killer up to full, otherwise she doesn't hit as hard. There we go. Quit following me. You know what? Just because it is annoying me, his damage output is so low. Let's see if I can. Okay, that one's been upgraded to eight. I didn't really upgrade these just because of the fact that you know I wasn't gonna keep them. Possibly, they're just kind of placeholders. So I'll upgrade this one some more. Cause I really don't want to waste my you know level ups. Oh, sweet, that was helpful. Okay, I'll, I'll take it. Um, I think I might put a little into this just for the time being. It's not great, but I, I really need, I think, a little bit more animal damage here. I got a lot of artifacts, so what did we get out of that? <laughs> Defense percentage. Oh, wow, that's great. Okay, let's hope that helps a little bit. At least make it go a little smoother. Too slow. Okay, let's see. Really hate mushroom guys. Oh yeah, it looks like it improved the damage a little. That's not bad. through one of my charged arrows. That seems kind of unfair. Okay, don't you start. Really? Don't you start with me. Go, Nahida, get it activated. There we go. No water resistant guys left. Okay, you two link up. Out of my way. The wind rises. 
There we go, that went a bit better. Nice, okay. Search for it. Okay, there we go. Come on, goblet. Flower. So yeah, it's not a bad flower. I'll save it possibly for like other stuff, but man. See what I mean, though? It just, like, my artifact luck just, like, drops off the face of the earth here. Quit following me. This is how it is anytime I've read- You guys are getting a glimpse into what it's like anytime I run artifact domains. And I know I'm running it on a lower level, but I'm only running it on level 80, not even- It's only one level below the max level, so it's not like, oh, I'm running it way, way, you know, below what I can do or something. Like, you know. That's when, like, my luck is just abysmal with artifacts, and I don't know why, because I don't have this problem usually. So it's just very disheartening. I'll go ahead and use this. Water guy, get out of my face. There we go. Bust you. Busted. Okay, Nahida, relink them if you would please. Thank you. That's far enough. I was trying to do that, but whatever. Quietly now. Busted. You two up. Go. Left. Just this annoying twerp. There we go. Nice. Take it easy. Go. Condensed resin. Come on. Something good. This is a circlet, and it's attack percentage with- Wow, Diva- Oh, gosh, guys. Come on. These are all crap. Like, literal crap. Take it easy. Oh, this is so disheartening. Like, it really is. It just makes it- It makes you not want to run them, because it's like, what's the point if you're never going to get anything good, you know? Again, if you, I was getting at least one each time, I'd be like, oh yeah, this is at least worth it, you know, because we're at least getting one that had usable one each time or something, even if it's not even for the character I'm going for, but it's like, everything has just been, like, absolute horrible. I didn't realize I could use that while I was in the air, huh? Don't you dare kill her again. Yeah. No, don't hit the one thing resistant to water. It's kind of stupid. Uh. Okay, what even hit me and knocked me out of the air? Really? You know what's annoying is normally I don't have this hard of a time when using the Wanderer of getting knocked around. Okay, I forgot to mark him first. Please, I don't even care if it's a purple. Just give me a usable artifact for him. At this point, I'll take anything. Wow, it's like they're getting worse. I mean, this is like... I'm not getting Resolution of Sojourner and Brave Heart pieces. I'm not even getting the set that I'm going for anymore. Why is it, like, getting worse? 
Oh man, this is bad. And I only need one more piece, because one more piece and I can have the set. At least I could get the set bonus in. The set bonus on that set is actually really good, especially for Wanderer. Quietly now. Here comes the cash. Let's start with it this time. Try to get rid of him as soon as possible. And of course the stupid slimes get in the way. Stop aiming for that slime and aim for this one. I mean this mushroom, not slime, but you know what I mean. Need to add him to the link. Thank you. Make yourself at home. Really? No, don't you dare kill him. Three. Activate that. Really? Really? Oh my gosh, I hate these guys so much. They're so annoying. That stupid water attack. I didn't realize that the cores could actually block them from shooting. I mean, that was actually kind of nice. Really? See, how does it go, like, really well, like, three times in a row, and then all of a sudden it just goes horribly? Does that seem fair? Thank you. Gosh, I gotta go stop by a statue. Also, I need to go make more condensed resin. Cause that's my last one. Some sands. Okay, that's not bad, I'll take that. I'll lose crit damage though, but I'll take the crit rate, I think. I'll check to see if that's even useful here. Like if he could use crit rate, cause if he can, then I'm, I'm taking it. Okay, so let's go and stop by a statue. I always stop at the one in Mondstadt just because it's easy. I like this one. <sighs> Heal up, everybody. There we go. Okay. I said characters. Don't know why I went there. Okay. Here. Crit rate is a second recommended. So what is his, like, ascension stat that he gets? He gets crit rate. So if it's really not needed... So I would be losing crit damage. It's not even leveled up though, but for the time being though, I think it might be worth it just because the fact, it was this one, right? Just because the fact that with the four piece set, normal attack speed is increased. And then it also increases my damage of normal charge and plunging attacks. That's why I'm like, it, it, it's, it's needed. And it's when a charge attack hits an opponent. That's why I'm like, I, I need this because I use a mixture of charge attacks and regular attacks with him. Yeah, I think we'll go for it. I mean, I don't think I got an attack, just an attack percentage one of these, did I? Oh, I did. It's just got really crappy stats. Maybe I go for that instead of the animal. No, but animal damage is so recommended because that's like all he does is just animal damage. It's crazy that I got all these and not a single animal damage one. It's just nuts. Yeah, I'll go for this for now. It's not going to be the best, but at least it's something. I'll go ahead and level it up too. HP percentage. Wow, I was really hoping for crit damage. Uh, go ahead and clear this out. Oh, uh, there's his. And I'll go ahead and put a little bit more into this one. Just because who knows, we might be holding on to this one for a while. And if I could get crit damage again, that would be awesome. 
<gasps> yes, it, it filled it into crit damage. Awesome. Okay, cool. So that wasn't a complete waste. Um, I guess that also means we'll be keeping... I'm going to be keeping you, because literally all these other ones are somehow worse, which I don't know how that's even possible. These are all really crappy artifacts, but at this point, I can't be too picky. Okay, I'll take that. That's actually really great. It's bad that I have to level it up to get the substats, but, like, you know, where I only had two substats starting on it, so to be able to get more. What's the fourth one? HP percentage, that's not great, but oh well, at least it'll help with survivability. Okay, not bad. Go ahead and put a little bit more into this one and see if we can get maybe get a crit damage substat. Go. And a recharge. Okay, that's not it's not great, but it's not horrible. How's his damage now? There we go. Almost a thousand damage. So that's not bad. Yeah, he's uh, How does Nahida do that much damage? I didn't realize her attack was that high, dude. Okay, good. So he's almost comparable to my Yalen attack for just like attack wise. I might give him a little bit more on this, because this is probably one of our better ones. Go. Try to see if we can maybe get maybe crit rate, I think, out of this might be nice. A little bit more crit rate. Let's see. No, I think it was a flat attack. That's not horrible. It's not great, though, by no means, but okay, this one could possibly get us more um, crit damage or even attack percentage, so we'll go for either of those. Sweet, I needed that double bonus. Here we go. <gasps> yes, it filtered it into crit damage. Sweet! Let's see how we doing. Sweet, 37 crit rate, 75 crit damage. That's not great on the crit damage wise, but hey, at this point, I'll take anything, honestly. So that's not bad. So he's got 972, so he has more attack than Yalen, which is great. His energy recharge is bad. His animal damage bonus is 42. Yeah, I don't. I think that's not bad. He really needs better talents and whatnot, but I just I, I can't go any higher. Well, this one I can actually upgrade even more. I didn't realize I had enough stuff to do that one another level. But okay, so I think next we'll farm artifacts. She actually has pretty good artifacts on her. Surprisingly, I was able to get her some pretty okay ones. The one that's hurting right now is my Yalin, which is surprising because she gets her... Nahida actually also has really good artifacts on her. It's mainly my Yalin. I need to go for Noblis, I believe is what I was going for, was my build I wanted to do. Because I think I wanted to do two Heart of Death, two Noblis, because I want to focus on doing more damage with her burst. So we'll go farm Noblis, I think, in the next You think I've got a short one. tongue? Yeah. I just tell it like it is. Go ahead and clear that. Nice. I mean, that wasn't bad, considering I want to go get more condensed resin. And that wasn't bad, considering the fact that we were using level 60s and 70s. And he only has a level 50 weapon, I think. I think that's what it was at. It was either level 50 or 60. Yeah, it was level 50. I was using a whole bunch of low-level stuff with really crappy artifacts. And I was still able to do a level 80 domain pretty well. So, I mean, they're, they're not bad. It's just they're, they're really mediocre compared to where they should be. But, yeah. Anyways, guys, we're going to end this episode here. And I totally forgot, but from leveling up characters and stuff, I actually have two standard banner wishes. So we're going to do those to end off the episode. So here we go. I don't know how, how close to pity are we. It's probably, like, I probably can't even see my numbers because it's been so long. Let's see. 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22. It's only been 22, so we're not close, but... It'll keep getting us there, and we're pretty close to another four star, so hopefully we'll get another character we can use, or maybe a duplicate of someone, like, maybe another Shinobu wouldn't be bad, or, I don't know. But here we go. First wish. Okay, nothing, which is fine. Maybe we'll get a weapon. I really, if I get a Widsith, I would be so happy, but also really bad, because I just spent all that time trying to level up his weapon, but it wouldn't be bad to get for him. Okay, and second wish. Okay, it's nothing. Oh, that's fine. I mean, that puts us at, how close are we to our next four star? Let's see, five, six, seven, eight. That puts us at eight, so we're not guaranteed on our next pull, but we're, we're close. There's no such I was just wondering, because I still have to level up. I can level up my Lynette and get a free wish out of ascending her once. Could I actually? Let's see, am I able to? 
Ooh, just shy. That'll be something we'll work towards that way if you get a free wish out of that. But anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching. If you liked the video, remember to like it. Comment down below with your thoughts and opinions. I look forward to hearing from you guys. Remember to subscribe if you want to see more from me in the future. And until next time, see ya!